This is a quadratic equation because the highest exponent on the variable is a 2. And I do not believe it factors, so I'm going to use a quadratic formula. A equals 2, B is negative 2, C is 3. So negative B would be negative, negative 2, it's negative B. This is our formula. Negative B plus or minus the square root of B squared minus 4AC all over 2A. All right, so we've got the negative B part, plus or minus the square root of B squared minus 4 times A times C all over 2 times A, 2 times 2 in this case. So to start to simplify, that's a positive 2 plus or minus the square root of 4 minus 4 times 2 is 8 times 3 is 24 all over 4. So this is 2 plus or minus the square root of negative 20 over 4. And that's 2 plus or minus the square root of negative 1 times 20 all over 4. And we know the square root of negative 1 is i. So 2 plus or minus i times the square root of 4 times 5, which is 20. I broke 20 down into factors where one of the factors is a perfect square. So this is 2 plus or minus i. Square root of 4 is a 2, so bring out a 2, times the square root of 5 over 4. Because this is an imaginary number, split it up. That's 2 over 4 plus or minus 2 over 4 i times the square root of 5. So that's going to be 1 half plus or minus i square root of 5 all over 2. So those are your two answers. Or you could write your answer as, well, this is the proper way.